How's it going guys and welcome back to the False Tech YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to stream Fortnite and GTA 5 and other games from your PC to your Nvidia Shield. There are some requirements for this. Uh, first, of course, you have to have Nvidia Shield. Um, the second requirement is um, your, you have to have a supported graphics card and I have this up for this exact reason. The current supported graphics cards uh, is a 1080, 1070, 1060, 1050, 1050 Ti, a Titan X, 900, 700, 600, 900M, 800M, uh, 700M, and Select 600M series. So if you have any of these um, graphics cards, then you will be able to do this. All right. Um, so now that we got that out of the way, let's go ahead and close this and let's show you how to do it. First thing we need to do is open up the uh, GeForce Experience. So let's open that up now. All right, so here's uh, three games that I uh, have currently. This is a new setup, so I don't have much. So all you need to do is hit the settings button here. Um, if you're not logged in, go ahead and log in. That will be a requirement as well. Click this uh, game stream. And all we gotta do now, guys, is go to the um, Go downstairs, look at my TV, go to NVIDIA Shield, and set that up now. I'll see you guys in a moment. Alright guys, welcome to uh, my TV here. I really don't feel like doing the high quality um, capture card, so I'm going to do it this way. But all you need to do is go to NVIDIA Games. We're going to go down, all the way down. Okay. Um, I'm going to log in. I don't. Let's see if this is a requirement. We're going to go to game stream PCs. There's my my PC, Arctic Wolf. I'm going to choose that guy. It gives us a code. So now let's go and type in that code. All right, guys. I'm in the middle upstairs, but the number did change, so I'm going to put in the new number, 9323. Connect, and we are connected. So now I can go downstairs and get the game started. So, let's go ahead and do that. All right, guys, we're back downstairs. We got it configured. Let's go ahead and choose our computer to make sure that it's connected. So we got, um, we see it at the green light. I don't know if you guys can see that due to the glare, but it is there. Um, we got audio on PC and connectivity. So what we're going to do, now that this, this is configured, I can get out of here. I can just go up into my games. Or my library click on game stream and here is where you can see your games and just to show you that it works I'm going to choose uh, Fortnite play and we'll set the remote down all right guys so it's running now is um, waiting for it to load so I played this earlier and I was getting a full 60 frames per second there was no whatsoever no uh, lag and I had a great experience down here without having to go to my computer and play it upstairs and if you guys would like to see some streams on this let me know I'll uh, definitely do that but as you can see it's logging in and there we are. I can log in and play. My name is Jod Phone here. And let me get a close up of the. Uh... So, yeah, and I am uh, running Epic settings. I got a 1070 Ti, i5, 8600K. Right now, they're both um, at normal clock speed. I haven't overclocked them. But yeah, I'll see you guys in a moment. We're going to head back up to my PC. All right, guys, we're back at my PC. And as you can see from when I launched the game, it's still up on my PC. And I, I, I do I do realize that this is the settings are the so what we're going to do now we're going to close the game and that is a quick tutorial on how to do this all right guys that's my video that's how you play Fortnite on the Nvidia Shield um, yes there is two things required that being the shield and a supported graphics card so there's uh, at this time there's no way to play it on the shield using the mobile app as it hasn't released onto Android at least I haven't found it on Android um, once it does get released on Android I'm sure there's a way you can port it over that may be something I visit later on but uh, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video 
don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Look in the description below if you want to uh, check out my, my current build. And if you would like to purchase anything, feel free to do that through my links as well. That will uh, help me, help you in the future, help me make videos and things like that. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.